Alright, in this video, I'm going to take a part from uh, the T408 and I'm going to put it into the Western Star. I'm going to use uh, bull bar, so we'll take it from one mod to the other. So I've got both folders open, Western Star 408. We'll start with taking the actual model of the bull bar and grabbing those files <coughs> and um, we'll get into it. So in the vehicle, truck, uh, upgrades. Now I already know the bull bars in this folder and the bull bar PMD is actually that bar 2. So over in the Western Star folders will go same thing vehicle truck upgrade I'm going to put it into the bumper WS and what I'm going to do is just going to take all of this so I'll copy and paste over yes alright so that's that part done now we'll go back to the main part of the folder and we want to go into the def, def files uh, on both mods. Okay, so we'll go into this one first. Uh, def, vehicle, truck, and you want to go down to accessories. Um, now that SII file for that bull bar in this mod is under bumper. Um, so I go there and if I open that one, so Thomas was the name of the folder that the model was in, but if I actually open that, you can follow the file structure through, so vehicle, truck, upgrade, Thomas, bar 2, which is the model that I'm going to be using, so I know this is the file that I need to put over into the Western Star folders, so I'll just close that for a minute. Uh, over in the Western Star we'll get into the same um, vehicle accessories folder accessories and we want to put that into the bumper WS folder so what we'll do we will copy that one and dump it over here we will open it up alright so this part here is what actually shows up the name of it in game when you select the accessory so we can put test one two three there um, another good thing to do is just open up another file that's in this folder already you can sort of get that uh, I don't know if you'd call it a structure but you'll notice obviously this is out of the 408 folder uh, that's out of the Western Star folder so we want that We'll copy and paste that 4800 and change change it from the Kenworth 408. Alright, uh, another thing we will have to change is this structure. So everything here will be the same vehicle truck upgrade, but it'll change because we've put it into the bumper underscore WS folder. So if what you do, if you want to check that, you just go back in your Western Star folder or the folder that you're putting the model into back to vehicle so we've gone vehicle next is truck upgrade so we're not going to have sorry I've already been through this but we're not going to put it in that folder this time <laughs> we'll look at the bumper WS file so we'll change that to bum underscore WS and we'll hit save on that um, I guess the next thing is close that we will open up the game and see if it worked I guess
We'll jump into a vehicle browser, saves opening the new one up again. Uh, into the Western Star, go into accessories, so bumper WS. There's our test one, two, three. If we click on it, so there you go. There's the bull bar on truck. Uh, by the looks of it, we we could jump into Z Modeler and move it forward a bit so it's not sitting hard up against the grill. Um, all these accessory slots, if I click on them, there'll be nothing in them. That's another thing to do, I guess. I, as I learn it all, um, do more videos. But I guess we could jump into Z Modeler and I'll show you how to move that and position it properly. Yes, it's got Kenworth mud flaps, but anyway. Um, so we'll just back back out of the game. Right, so in the Z modeler, uh, assuming everyone knows how to import a mod, I'm not going to go through all that stuff. Um, find my model, bumper WS. Where are you? Can't remember what it was called now. Default uh, vehicle truck. Bar O two. So back here, bar O2 should be there it is okay so all we do, we, we, we want to move that bar forward a little bit um, so we basically just do that click your move tab there, we want to select the whole thing it's selected um, I suck at this move thing so it's on one of these axes we're going to move on Oh, got the right one first go. So I've just moved it forward a little bit, just guessing. It's a guessing game from here, so we'll try that. That's it. Uncheck that. And then we will export back overwrite that bar too. Yes. Jump back in game. Let's see if it's moved forward or not. Should have. in the vehicle browser back in the bumper test and yes it has so it's moved way too far forward but that's the general idea it's like I said it's a bit of a guessing game you're back in and out of the game um, to see how close it is or if it's on you know if it's at the right spot but that is basically it that's how you take a model, a part, whatever, from one mod to the other. Um, I hope that helps, and uh, thanks for watching.